that's out of the bag with Brickheads. Brickheads are becoming some of the best investments you can make when LEGO investing. Brickheads are cheap to purchase, easy to store, and easy to ship. You can easily double your money with some of these sets. Here are all the Brickheads retiring this year and how I think they'll do in retirement. Item number 40377, Donald Duck. With the success of Mickey and Minnie Mouse, I think this set will follow some of that success. Donald is not as popular as Mickey and Minnie, but I think this set will do great in retirement. I could see the set selling for $40 to $50 in retirement. Item number 40378, Goofy and Pluto. Goofy and Pluto are iconic characters, and I believe Goofy and Pluto are more popular than Donald Duck. As a result, I believe the set could sell for $40 to $70 in retirement. Item 40476, Daisy Duck. I think Daisy Duck will follow exactly how Donald Duck has done and could fetch anywhere from $40 to $50 in retirement. But if it does follow how the Minnie Mouse Brickheads has done a little better than the Mickey Mouse, there is a chance it could fetch a little more than Donald. Item number 40477, Scrooge McDuck, Huey, Dewey, and Louie. These are iconic characters, but not as iconic as Donald, Daisy, Goofy, and Mickey. As a result, I believe this set will sell for $40 to $60. The key to making money with this set is getting it on sale. But be warned, multiple packs like these can always be remade into singles. So these type of investments are riskier. I will probably only buy maybe 5 to 10, but no more than that because I believe they will be remade into singles later on. Item number 40495, Harry, Hermione, Ron, and Hagrid. I'm passing on the set. Many of the figures have already been made. There's not enough profit for me to buy this set. Item number 40539, Ahsoka Tano. This set is going to do great in retirement. I think this set will sell anywhere from $30 to $50, but you might be saying that's a low amount, especially for a Star Wars set. Yes, it is low, and I'm giving it a conservative number simply for the fact that this set is over hoarded. Everyone and their mama is buying a Sokotano, and as a result, it will be a harder sell. You might have to hold the set quite a while before you start seeing decent profits. Item number 40540 Lion Dance Guy. I think this set is a great looking set, however, I will not be investing in this. I think this set will not do well in retirement. You'll be lucky if maybe you could sell it for $18 to $20, but after fees, you're going to pretty much break even. Lion Dance Guy looks great, but it's a pass for me. Item number 40541, Manchester United Go Brick Me. This set is terrible. I don't think this should be purchased. It's not a good theme to invest in, and I think you will end up losing money if you buy this set. Item number 40542, FC Barcelona Go Brick Me. This is a terrible set, just like the Manchester United. There's no demand for it. It's not popular in the States, and I think it's too niche. I think if you bought this set, along with the Manchester United, you will end up losing money. Item number 40550, Chippendale. I love this set. However, I don't think this set will do well in retirement. I think maybe if you're lucky, it will sell for $30 and you might make a $10 profit. So as a result, I'm going to pass on this set. Item number 40553, Woody and Bo Peep. This set is great and Woody is one of the most popular characters in the Toy Story movies. And as a result, this set will sell anywhere from $30 to $70. However, I do believe that they will sell Woody individually just like they did Buzz Lightyear, which will affect the price of the set and will drop it to a range of $30 to $40. Since there is that risk, I will not be purchasing a bunch of these. I will only buy 5 to 10, just in case they don't remake Woody later on. Item number 40560, Professors of Hogwarts. I love that they chose these four professors, however, I will be avoiding this set unless it goes on sale. If it goes on sale for half off, so $20, I might buy 5 to 10 in hopes that I make around 10 to $15 a profit. Item number 40622, Disney's 100th Celebration. This is a great set. You get Oswald the Lucky Rabbit, Mickey Mouse, Snow White, and Tinkerbell. These are iconic characters, and I believe they will sell each one of these characters individually in the future. If you are buying this set to invest in, it is on sale now for $27.99, so it's going to disappear any day now. I personally will only be buying 5 to 10 just in case the set takes off. Item number 40623, Battle of Endor Heroes. You get Luke Skywalker, R2-D2, Lando, Wicket, Princess Leia, in the Return of the Jedi outfits. And for that reason, I love this set. 
Once this set retires, I think this set will sell anywhere from $60 to $80. I'm hoping to get at least 50 of these before they retire. Item number 40624, Alex. I think this is a terrible set. There is no money to be made with this set. Item number 40625, Llama. I think this set is terrible. There's no money to be made. This is a set that I will be passing on. Item number 40626, Zombie. I think this is a terrible set. There's no money to be made on this set. I will be passing. Item number 75317, The Mandalorian and the Child. This is the set that just will not die. I will be avoiding the set at all cost. I'm glad I did not buy any when it was supposed to retire, but then it got extended. This set is hoarded, and everyone has a ton of these sets. So for that reason, I will not be buying any. Thanks for watching my video. As always, do your own research, have some fun, make some money. Video is not financial advice. Any statements made are my views and is for entertainment purposes only and should not be taken as financial advice. Do your own research before making any financial investments.